right. The race you've all been wanting to see tonight. The, the boys 400. Race of the day. We've got four, that's right, four guys in this field who've gone under 47 seconds this outdoor season, including Javian Green featured right there in lane four. To the outside of him, we got Aiden Dixon, was US number one earlier season, both indoors and outdoors in the 400. Makai Gammons has been a standout, one of the nation's top returnees the last couple years in the 400 out of Halea, Miami Lakes. And Makai Danzi, I think, is the favorite in this one based off of his victories this season. He won on this track at Bob Hayes. He won at the Florida Relays. He won at the FSU Relays. He's run against some of these guys head to head and has not been beaten this spring at the 400 meter distance. But this has four guys capable of doing something special and among our nation's best. You did mention Aiden Dixon, you know, um, you did mention that he's probably one of the top runners as well. And uh, maybe looking for a little revenge here today. So currently ranked rankings in the U.S. right now, Danzy's number five, Dixon's, Dixon's number, number 12, and 20. Hey, gentlemen, on your mark. And Javen Green, number 14. Correct. So five, four of the top 20 ranked 400 meter athletes in the nation right now in the 400 are about to go off. Set. Camera off. This is it, this is it. This is what we've been waiting for. The horses have left to shoot. Osby, Miller, Johnson, Green, Dixon, Gammons, Danzy, Bezoza, Johnson. Looks like Danzy and Gammons getting out strong on the outside. They're feeding off each other, both of them. Let's see what happens off this curve. Gammons last year painfully second in this event. Trying to win his first state title. Danzy, though, has been the man all spring. It's going to be a battle. Danzy now shifting gears. Dixon trying to come on. Green on the inside. Into the finish. Be Micaiah Danzy, your champion. 46-11, your champion. Dixon comes on late for second to nip Gammons for th second. JV and Green for four. So three of those four ended up breaking 47 here today. And the pre four race favorites came in. Oh, in, in one, two, three, four. It's pretty crazy. It's, it's insane when, when you know the runners have been running well all year and they're able to execute it and, and, and do just fine here at the state. And Danzy stays perfect, basically. In Florida. So we excited to see him on the national level potentially in the postseason as he's he's beat them all basically so he's been unbeatable that boys 400 lived up danzy gammons tried to go for that first state title but danzy wanted it definitely gave get that first one definitely gave himself a shot the way they shot out the block yeah that was great seeing seeing that first 200 with gammons especially with danzy giving him a challenge heading over now to the university of georgia next year mr gammons will be running part of the 